And lastly, I got this, which I think is a brilliant deal. It's the um, Lego Ninjago Ninjoids Attack uh, book thingy. But it was £7 and it's been reduced to 3 which I think I mainly got it for this Zane because I don't have him yet. And I, Zane's my favourite ninja, I love him. And uh, I'm just going to talk about him for like a few minutes. Or a couple. So yeah, that's the Zane, Ninja Zane. It's not the one with the that one with the battle scarred face. It's the normal face and the normal suit. Just to say that. Now, I love Zane very much. He is my favourite ninja, obviously. And I have a lot of the Zanes. I think I've got five. I do have the original somewhere. I have two of the original Zane, but I've lost them both, sadly. But I know they're in my house somewhere. So yeah, I have the original Zane, two of him. I have the ZX Zane and the NRG Zane. And because I have two of the original Zane, I got Kendo Cole, so I can also make a my own Kendo Zane as well. And now I've got the Ninja Zane. I'll have five or four at the moment. Or maybe even six if I can find both of them on the Kendo Cole. And I'm going to try and get all of them, all the Zanes, someday. But it's uh, quite expensive. So, yeah, um, oh yeah, um, when I, when Jago first came out, I saw Zane and I was like, oh my god, I love him so much. He's so cool. Uh, mainly because of his suit. I mean, I can't really show you the original suit because I've lost it. But imagine that this one has the original suit. I don't know. And I thought ninjas, they're so cool because Lego brought them out a ninja theme, and I was. Well, I didn't even know about the original ninja theme. And I thought, Lego ninjas, this is awesome. And I bought Zane the Spinner when, like, as soon as it came out. And I just played around with him loads. Took him everywhere with me. He, I just, like, he was my favourite Lego figure. My favourite Lego theme was Ninjago. And then S the Rise of the Snakes was okay. Because it brought out this one. And the NRG. And I thought, yeah, this is a pretty decent series. And then the Stone Warrior series came out. I didn't get any of them sets, but I wish I got the Kimono Zane from that. I have, I've only seen the episodes. Up, haven't even finished Rise of the Snakes yet. Um, I'm, a, I'm around where you like meet Dareth in the series. Um, but yeah, I, I didn't think the Stone Warrior series was that good, even though I haven't seen the episodes. But the sets don't look very good, and the figures don't look very good to me, except the Zane. Except the ninja suits, I think they're okay. And then the Ninjoid series came out, which is this one. And I thought, wow, this is Lego like did it right this time. They included the ninja's hair because Kai did not have any Lego hair. People people were using um sleepy head hair and they were using extra force hair. Nothing suited him until they brought they made a new piece which is Kai's hair. And then people finally could get it. And Zane's hair is well was very rare before then. And Cole's was pretty rare as well. And I love these new ninja masks that they brought out as well. Especially because in the sets you get two of them. And I got two black ones for Cole, so you can make really cool like masked people. And the techno blades are pretty cool as well. I I got the I got Cole and J in the uh, Cole Mech and the K uh, Cole Mech and J like uh, it's like a tank thing, mini tank sort of thing. I got that and I got the Kai in the um, Ninjago magazine, but he came with a plain ninja hood. But I got the tournament Kai, so I put the mask and the hair on that one to make the techno. So I didn't actually get a Techno one in a set. It's like two figures in one to combine to make this one. So yeah, I guess that's enough talking about Zane. Uh, this has probably gone on for a bit too long, sorry. Um, so the first thing I'm going to do is... Okay, here we have the last part, which is the Ninja Book or Ninja Magazine thingy. Now I'm not going to show you what's inside because it's going to take way too long. So what I'm going to do is open the Zane 
to get build it and show you it. So you open it up and wait a minute. You open it up here. And it's like this with that purple envelope. Now I don't really know how to get into this, so I will cut out the video for a second here and come back on when I've opened it. Okay, here it is. Uh, you're supposed to cut the purple envelope, but I just managed to slide it out the bottom. So here's the back. Oh, I love that back, buddy. Okay, let's open it. But, I mean, this is a really cool thing you could transport other Lego figures in, I guess. Like a bigger display stand or anything. Let's get that whole piece of Okay, let's build it up. This piece is cool. I've wanted a white one for quite a while. White bandana mask, or whatever they are. Go over a uh, mini figure mouth. Okay. And this hair is really pretty rare until this year, I think, or last year. And they brought out, obviously, this Zane, but they also brought out an Ultra Agent called um, Zane Tear comes with an agent from Ultra Agents called Agent Chase Swift and he has this hair, blue glasses and like a dark blue, navy blue suit. But anyway, back to Zane. Here he is. And Zane has three different outfits in the one techno series. He has this one, he has the glider one which is like straps all across from every side, four straps, and he has the one where that flap um, is like pulled um, away, and you can see like robot his robot body, and he's got also a half robot eye. Here's the back, which is nice, and also I really wanted this same because now I can the complete set of the original four ninjas from the Ninjoid theme. Here they all are. Jay falling over. Here they are. And I only have Jay and Zane's Technic Blade. I don't have Kyle calls. I'm not sure if I plan on getting them, but anyway, I'm so glad I have them. And Jay and Cole's um, ninja outfits match each other pretty well. Zane's not so much. It's quite a lot different. And Kai's is just completely different. And I'm pretty sure Lloyd's is really different as well. And here's the backs. Obviously they match too. Zane's doesn't match that much. And Kai's... Yeah, it's, it's they're, they're kind of similar, and I like how they all have the element with like Cole has that with like rocks around it, Jay has lightning around his, Zane has ice, Kai has fire. And I'm so also glad and happy that I've got every colour of the ninja mask now, including Lloyd, because I got tournament Lloyd or not tournament, well, the one with, sleep, with no sleeves, I got that Lloyd, and also. This Zane is another good addition to my Zane collection. And I also have two original Zanes, so I can, but they're both lost, and a Kendo Coal, so I can make original Zane and Kendo Zane. So if I had them, I would have six Zanes altogether. And actually, I'm pretty sure I have two of this Zane, but I'm not sure. NRG is probably my favourite at the moment. So this wraps up the video, I guess. Sorry that it's so long. I just start yabbering on and on about the stuff that's unrelated. So, um, yeah, sorry again about this video being long. I'm even yabbering on about it being long. Thanks for watching this. Like, comment and subscribe. See you next time. Bye.